It is Friday, and I'm going to meet my baby at uh, this little joint for happy hour. We're going to hang out for a little while, and then on our way home, we're going to stop at the grocery store and get all the, the things that we need so we can have a make-your-own-pizza cook-off. Okay, so just so y'all know, I beat Corey at everything. Like, he's a big whiny baby because I'm always whooping that with uh, anything that we do. So, we're going to go shoot some pool right now, and I'm going to beat him at that. And then we're going to have a pizza cook-off, and I'm going to beat him at that. And he's just going to be boo-hoo crying all night. So, you know, I hate it for him, but he, sh he shouldn't challenge me. He said, he texted me and said, pizza cook-off challenge tonight you and me i said oh bring it on sucker so y'all are gonna see you're gonna see whose pizza is the best tonight i'm gonna show you it's gonna be mine don't hit me all right we're at publix we're gonna shop for the pizza cook-off and he's gonna probably try to like creep up behind me to see what ingredients i'm getting but it's not gonna work okay i know all your tricks you don't know anything about pizza. I know everything about pizza, and I'm about to whoop him in this pizza cook-off. We got our friend coming over to be the judge, unbiased judge. Look at this. You know why you're gonna lose? Why? Because you're gonna make a pizza poo. Brittany's not gonna win. She's never made a pizza before. She's never even eaten a pizza before. Here's exactly what's gonna be on her pizza. Lots of cheese, sauce, bacon, pepperoni, maybe some green peppers. Boring. She has no idea what she's doing. A loser. Okay. And guess who's in the house? Yeah. The judge. The pizza cook-off judge is here. Rock. That's right. Here we go. All right, Brittany, so explain to me what you're doing with okay. the pizza here. So I'm making a Philly yeah. cheesesteak pizza and a sausage pepperoni pizza. Okay. Both of which will have multiple cheeses. We've got a little fontina some provolone, some mozzarella. I've even got my secret ingredient, which is cream cheese. Cream cheese sounds good. You weren't supposed to say that out loud. Uh, Corey's trying to steal my idea. All right, Corey, what you got going on over here? I make my own dough, not none of this pre-made BS over here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, what, what ingredients do you got going on in your pizza here? Uh, I'm making a... It's a secret. A, mar a margarita pizza? A and margarita a, pizza? Just a regular meat lovers pizza. Oh, okay. Meat lovers and a margarita. So white sauce and red sauce. Oh, pizza. yeah. So we're you're gonna, making two pizzas. We're each making two. Okay. But I'm going to win them all. Here. No, it is. Oh, yeah. So we're meeting up the Philly right now with a little roast beef, deli, thinly sliced roast beef. And the secret is what you said? The secret is that you have to evenly spread the meat all over so every bite you get a delicious, meaty, cheesy, all ingredient bite every time. Yeah. Where'd you get the sauce from? Extra pepper. What is that that you just put it on the pan the there, Corey? The, the finest cornmeal. So like what does the cornmeal do? Yeah. So it doesn't <laughs> stick to the pan. Exactly. All right. <laughs> Me today and said, Pizza cook office. All right, so what's going on Bring here? Bring it on. All right, so I'm, oh my I'm God, heating up looks, the pepperoni. Oh my God. Yeah. We don't use them little pepperonis around the here. Big, we use the yes. big deli style. A whole I have piece to judge. first. I'm, I'm gonna taste the crust first because then no, we'll do the overall this last. Right. Smells good. It's hot. How's that crust? 
dead. This is good. good? Mm -hmm. Really good? Yeah, you it's, like that? Yeah. Does anyone else have these? It's crunchy, good consistency. <laughs> yeah, <hang on. laughs> the toppings here. Is he the main character, Judge? All right. Yeah. The toppings. All the toppings look like they're good. Ready? Cooked yes, together. I'm, I'm We're going to see how they complement each other. Okay. Mm. Is that amazing or what? Are you from? Melt in your mouth. Mm. That's really good. Crust toppings, creativity. <laughs> Pretty creative. Very creative. No, I know, I know. Um, yeah. The doneness. It looks like everything is cooked to perfection. To perfection. The cheese is melted right. <laughs> the meat is uh, cooked right. The garnish on top. The crust. Everything. Okay. Pretty good. Pretty good. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Yeah. All right, this is the uh, Philly. Presentation, fail. <laughs> hey, it's um, a pizza yeah. pizza! So you learned from the last I'm presentation. Like, oh. <laughs> uh, you had a chance to get it right and you didn't. Yeah. Uh, I'll tell you right now, this thing is soggier than a wet fish. Mm hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's Pretty very soggy. soggy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm kind of scared. This is <laughs> pretty. This not is done. Bad. Not done. Hold on. <laughs> I'm going, <laughs> I'm, I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Eat it. Mm -mm. Is it bad? Mm -hmm. Do I need to put it back in? In the garbage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh -uh. That's not good. <laughs> okay. that's, hor that's horrible. As he continues oh, to eat it. Terrible. I gotta, tell, I gotta judge the rest so of the good. pizza. I like that. All right, Judge. Like this that. is Corey's. <laughs> Look at this. He needs to get deducted What points. is this? Hold on a second. This is, okay, don't get rid of that. I'm not done with that yet. Yeah, that's mine. All right, he so what's the one on the left here? First of all, oh, let me just say the presentation is phenomenal. These plates. <laughs> Whatever. Are, nobody wants to eat homemade gourmet pizza on paper plates. This well, is you, perfect. Well, that's because the first two slices you had weren't gourmet. Right. Well, exactly. <laughs> um, Whatever. Mine is the way crust, better. without even cutting into it, I could tell that it's homemade crust, which is perfect. Yeah. So this one on the left is what? Uh, deep dish. Supreme. Have you guys already tried it? Mm-hmm. All right. It's good. Don't tell me. <laughs> Let me call you a <laughs> <laughs> That's crust, homemade crust. The crust is a little on the cook, but definitely has that that <laughs> make you feel that make that make you feel good flavor to it. You know, because uh, it's yeah. homemade. So. Make you feel good. Yeah. yeah, yeah so yeah. even though it's a little on the cook, it's still good. Yeah. So the toppings, even though pizza is like really really bad for you, and I know it's bad for you, it has like a really like healthy feel to it. You know, it's not very you know heavy. So, topping was great, creativity, great, um, dumbness, you know, we talked about the crust. This one, what is this here? Margarita pizza. Margarita pizza. Alright. Crust looks good. Just go without just the toppings, just the crust by itself. He's consistent, isn't he? I text the judging That crust, it's amazing. Amazing. What? Yes. Whatever. Um. You know she had another piece over there. The third piece. Let's go with the toppings of this margarita pizza. Is that what we're calling it? Yeah, this is a margarita pizza. Can I want some wine? Isn't margarita pizza? It's just amazing. Crazy. That's what it is. <laughs> margarita pizza is amazing. It's like it's, it's got this like excellent. sweet <laughs> tang to it, you know, like. <laughs> The margarita pizza really makes me. My mouth is watering. So, <laughs> oh my God. I'm about to get perfect. So, <laughs> we're gonna go. What was the other one? Uh, margarita. Mar my, my version of it. I'm gonna go with Marg. Marg Simpson. Presentation oh, ten. Got the presentation. Crust ten oh, plus. Ten plus. Oh my goodness. The toppings. What? Ten. <laughs> Oh, I'm, just, I'm just being honest here. I'm Which being one? Honest. In the middle of a perfect game. Creativity. Oh. Ten. No. Yes. That is the most. No. Oh, I'm sorry. That pizza's been around for centuries. And I don't care if it's been that around for centuries. Nothing to it. What about this? Was it done? 
Just go nine. I'm gonna give, go, give it a game perfect. I'm gonna give you a seven. Now. I'm gonna give you a seven since you try to tell me how to be the judge. So, um, 10, 20, 30, 40, 47 overall. So, so Brittany got a 32 on her meat, mm -hmm. a 19 on her Philly. Kind of what? Philly. Oh, no. Um, Corey got a 31. He was only one point behind. He got a 31 on the deep dish and he got a 47. Oh my gosh, that was. <laughs> no way. So good job to Corey for one of yeah, those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so apparently Corey won the pizza cook off. Corey too, cheated. Too smart. What? What? I smell a sore loser. Stinks so bad. It's coming from you. guys for watching and even though Corey won the stupid pizza challenge I don't think he really won I think that he cheated and because he gave Rocky a little letter that said Rocky was so handsome all right the only reason Corey won is because of the little note he left on Rocky's pizza that said he was handsome so he cheated but whatever Corey won I'm not gonna be a sore loser I'm gonna say you won congratulations you're the pizza master